In the aftermath of President Donald Trump's comments that immigrants from Haiti and Africa come from shithole countries, users on Twitter are pointing out a story from an immigrant from Ghana who sacrificed his life to save others during a deadly fire in the Bronx over the holidays. Emmanuel Mensa was a 28-year-old immigrant from Ghana who joined the Army National Guard. He was living with friends of his father, a married couple, and their four children. When the fire started, he was able to get that family to safety and then ran back into the building and pulled four more people from the fire to safety. Mensa went in to grab a fifth person but was not able to make it out of the building and is believed to have died of smoke inhalation. Now, Twitter users are posting Emmanuel Mensa's picture and sharing his story as a rebuke to Trump's reported Oval Office comments that African countries are shitholes. The most widely shared tweet comes from conservative commentator Bill Kristol, who said, Two weeks ago, a 26-year-old soldier raced repeatedly into a burning Bronx apartment building, saving four people before he died in the flames. His name was Private Emmanuel Mensa, and he emigrated from Ghana, a country Donald Trump apparently thinks produces very subpar immigrants.